You gotta have swag, really. I mean, to be a DB, you, you gotta have swag. You gotta be able to run. <laughs> you gotta be able to run and keep running. To be good this year, we got the same thing. You know, if, if number one guy goes down, we gotta have a guy that can step up. You know, we gotta win every game we can, and you know, the valley's tough, so we gotta have guys that can come in. You gotta think that the person you're going against is not better than you. You have to know you're better than them even before the play starts. You know, first, second, third, fourth string, you know, I don't care if you're two freshmen, you know, you gotta know the play to come in and just do your thing. It's up to us at the end of, of the day. I mean, if they throw a long pass, everybody's gonna see is you one-on-one -on -one with that receiver. You gotta have the swag and confidence that you're gonna stop the player in front of you and that they're not gonna score against you. Coach Kleinman, man, he's a great coach. I mean, since he got here, he just made our whole defense and our and every individual on the team, the game just get that much better. He's just a great overall coach, and like he's not only gonna coach you, but he'll, you know he'll be your buddy too. His philosophy is, you know what? Why yell at you? I'm gonna teach you how to do it. He's kind of more of a friendly guy. He's, you know, he's gonna help you through it. You know, he's gonna help you get to know what you gotta do to get better. And if he didn't come here this year, I wouldn't know how good I would have been the last year. He's a cool coach too. You could talk to him about anything you want to talk to. He'll joke around with you if you want to. He'll be serious with you. It's anything you want from him. So he's like a good coach. Here. Definitely have fun. You're like, you know, meetings get long, and you know, we'll have two, you know, two, two and a half hour meetings, and you know, sometimes, you know, some days it's just strict, strict, you know, you know, playbook, film, you know, we don't have that like that much time to do anything, and then you know, other days there's, you know, midway through film, you know, crack a joke, crack a joke, you know, I mean, like, I mean, some days are strict, and then other days, you know, he'll crack a joke every now and again. So he's he's a fun guy to be with. Uh, what makes me go on the field? I mean, it's just a, a dream I always had playing football. I'm a Division One football. Coach Bowl gave me the chance to come in and play the game that I love to do. I study a lot. I work a lot. I try to be first at everything I do, no matter if it's a sprint, no matter if it's anything out there. I'm trying to be the first one. We've been doing some off-season running, and uh, at the end of it, when everyone's dog tired and everyone's done, you know, he's doing an extra couple, you know, 200-yard sprints, and uh, you know, it's just the small things like that are gonna make him, you know, be an All-American again. Uh, he's one of the faster D-backs that we have on the team. He's real quick, he's real elusive at anything he does. I mean, basically we just try to get our job done. I mean, I know he's gonna do his job on his side of the field, and he know I'm gonna do the same thing on my side of the field. All right, Bobby Oman. Uh, he's been here for as long as I've been here. We stayed in the dorm together. And Bobby Oman, one thing about him, he doesn't want nobody to lift more than he does. I swear, Bobby, if you bench 400, Bobby has to bench 405. The stud. I call him Studzik. He swears he can do anything and everything on the field. See, duds. <laughs> he's, a, he's a feisty one, definitely. Uh. He swears he's an All-American quarterback. He always wants to play both ways, even though we both know he can't. Colton Hegel, beast. He's the guy who always thinks he knows what he's doing, even though he's always wrong. A strong safety, he comes down to make a lot of plays that a lot of people on the team are just like surprised that he can do stuff like that. You know, he just doesn't care who, you know, what size you are. You know, he'll come up high, he'll come up low. He just does, you know, whatever he wants, pretty much. He's just, you know, one of our best tacklers on the team, one of the best defense players we got, and uh, he's only gonna be a junior this year, so it's really nice to have him.